okay in this video we'll try to understand how to write uh, to a file in java uh, the most easiest or the most beginning step how to write is there are two ways the first way is the file input output stream the file input stream and the file output stream the file output stream is used to uh, write to file for example i am creating here the object of file st output stream equals to new file output stream and here in the file section we are going to give the name of the file which we are going to create for example delhi.txt so what i am going to write is in the delhi.txt file the thing is the file output stream accepts only bytes so what we will do here is we will create a string for example let's create a string as a string a equals to i am in india okay there is in india okay and the next thing is we'll have to convert this string into a byte for example for that we will use the method known as dot get bytes it encodes the string into a sequence of bytes okay okay that's it and now we are good to write this data that is bytes in this file daily.txt by using this object so let's do it f o dot uh, it has a method uh, write which accepts uh, bytes so let's do it and we are passing a b which is a byte stream okay that's it and what is going here we are yeah we have to throw an exception that's the input output exception okay this is done let's test it by print printing su okay and let's run it yeah it is showing here as su means we are we have written this i am an india string to this delhi.txt file okay uh, now we have to read it so we'll use file input stream object uh, let's create the object as file f5 will new file input stream so what which file we are going to read? We are going to read the delhi.txt. Okay. And uh, to read, uh, we'll let's initialize the variable i equals to zero. To read, we use the while loop. Okay. In the while loop, uh, we'll try to iterate through this. For example, we'll use i equals to f i dot read means through this uh, fi we will read the delhi.txt file okay and we will check whether it is equal not equals to minus one if it is equals to minus one means we have reached to the end of the file means there are not no data and after this we will print the value of i okay and we will have to convert this i into a character so we will cast it to teacher okay this is done and uh, let's print it out let's see what's there okay i'm in india it is giving you and let's try to print it in a simple line and see what happens yeah i am in india the other way to read and write to the file is file reader and writer so let's write to a file using the file writer object oh my god i'm writing fly writer file writer let's name its object to the fw uh, new 
file right and we are going to create a text file now name is london dot txt okay and in file writer we do not need to convert a string to bytes we can easily give it the data as a string so fw dot write see this one it accepts string okay and we can pass anything for example i am in britain okay london is in britain that's it okay so we have written to the london.txt file and now uh, now let's uh, read the file what we have written there and let name the object be far file reader okay equals to new file uh, reader yeah it is here same, same thing we have to give london dot txt and here again we are going to use the same um, technique to read the file that's it and uh, yeah let's give here a simple sysout okay and let's run it yeah it is better uh, if we close fw because we don't need, need it okay 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 i have to change it to fr yeah yeah it is giving us i'm in britain okay and if you want to check it change it to for i mean britain now let's see it must reflect there and now run it yeah i'm in britain now it's giving so that's it okay thank you guys